Okay, using the right render node in Toon Boom Harmony. So you might be used to just using the file export uh, movie option for having exported everything up until now from Toon Boom. Uh, for example, for critique purposes or for your demo reel or whatnot, which is fine. Um, but it limits the type of outputs that you can actually export to in terms of the codec and the quality and, and all that good stuff. The other way to render out of Toon Boom, and this is the way that you would do really high level, high quality renders, is through the right render node. Um, by default, there's always one that's kicked out the composite to display and render right. I've gotten rid of it for this specific scene. So what you're going to do is go to your node library, look up right. You're going to find this little scribbly film wheel like this. And you're going to want one for each separate render that you want. So I want a render for my background, my shadow, my girl animation, and my foreground. So I'm going to set this up. I'm going to go in and basically choose the folder like that. I'm going to give it sort of a generic name to begin with. So this one's going to be background, and I can call this. I want to choose the format. So again, here is the plethora of export options you have for the render right node. PNG4 is really kind of the best. It has alpha. It's a nice high quality. Click close. And then what you can do is just copy and paste each of these little guys for each different render that you want and go in and basically just change the name change the destination. I've already made these folders up in the frames folder um, ahead of time, like a cooking show. Here, this is the girl. And again, I'm just going to choose the girl folder. And then here. So by doing the one and copying it, I've already sort of set the destination and the naming convention and the file type up so I don't have to choose it every single time I go into a new node. And you're basically going to connect it. So for the girl in the shadow, I'm going to connect these two because I'm going to export the entire sequence. Go to File, Export, Render Right Nodes, or Shift Command Control Y. And you can either do all the frames or selected frames. Uh, field composite options. If you want to preview while it's doing it, you can click OK. It's going to render everything out, kick it out like so usually goes from 0 to 100, so it's going to basically finish in no time at all. Oh, there we go. And then what I would do is for the foreground and background, since it's not a moving camera image and it's really just a static image, um, I don't need to do all 39 frames of the same background image. So I could go to File, Export, Render Right Nodes. Again, Shift Apple Y is a really nice shortcut to know. Selected frames. Maybe I just want the first frame. Click OK. It's going to render those two out. And then when I go into my folder, it'll only have rendered outside a uh, one single PNG for the background, one PNG for the foreground, and then the entire sequence for the girl and the entire sequence for the shadow. Now you can bring it into whatever post-processing compositing software, such as After Effects or Premiere, that you would want. And that's how to export high-quality exports out of Toon Boom.